Hi dear all students. In last video of science, we completed explanation about lesson number one, the leaving word. I hope you understand all that part and you completed all short notes. Now today I will explain something more about exercise in this part six. So after short notes, you have to give heading in your notebook for exercise for the first lesson of science. Question number first is here. Find my match. That is match the following. Make a group and directly dash. Make a second column as answer column instead of cross method. Answer of lotus. Lotus answer is D. That is adapted to live in water. Alloy second alloy answer is adapted to live in desert that is option C. Third cascuta answer is B. Historical roots for adaptation of food absorption of food. Fourth one Venus flytrap answer is A flower and leaves attract insects. So complete this match in your notebook in a nice way. Now question number two. Question number two is here. Read the paragraph and the following questions. It's like English para reading and you have to answer the questions as best on that para. I am a penguin. I live in polar region covered by snow. My abdomen is white my abdomen is white my skin is thick with a layer of fat underneath my body is spindle shape my wings are small my toes are web we live in flocks so from this para we understand that this information is about an animal which is living in polar region and the name of that animal is pegwin Question number one, they ask to us, why is my skin white and thick and why is there a thick layer of fat underneath? Then due to they are living in polar region, the region is always covered with ice or snow. To protect their body from extreme cold, they have a skin white and thick. Because of thick skin, heat is generated and they get saved in that atmosphere as well as due to the white color which is mixed with the surrounding ice color they protect themselves against predators so this all point you have to write in point wise way answer one two three you may make a point second question why do we live in flocks sticking close to each other because staying in a flock, one is protected against the attack from predator. It becomes easier for parental care. Also by sticking to each other, the body heat is also not lost for the surrounding. So create heat in body. They are sticking close to each other. So this you write in point in your own way now. Which geographical region do I inhabit and why? So penguins are in polar region. They mention in the first only, especially like uh, Antarctic region. There is abundant food available for the penguins and thus they are seen in, in this region. Fourth, which adaptations should we have to enable you to live permanently in the polar region and why? Then if in order to live in permanently for polar region the body should adapt it to cold temperature there should be thick layer of fat and thick skin to protect the body the ability to regular body temperature should be extremely good for the survival so this answer you write in a point wise way then question number three who is lying See student on screen, question is there, who is lying? Cockroach said, I have five legs. Right answer, cockroach is lying. Cockroach have six legs. 
यू विल राइट करेक्टेड सेंटेंस ऑल्सो हैन माई टोज आर वेब हैन इज ऑल्सो लाइंग इट्स टोज आर नॉट वेब कैक्टस माई फ्लैशी ग्रीन पार्ट इज अ लीव नो कैक्टस इज लाइंग इट्स फ्लैशी एंड ग्रीन पार्ट इज अ स्टेम सो कंप्लीट दिस क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इट्स मे कम इन एग्जाम फॉर वन मार्क हाफ मार्क फॉर टेलिंग हु इज लाइंग एंड हाफ मार्क फॉर करेक्टेड सेंटेंस क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर रीड ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट राइट अ पैराग्राफ अबाउट एडेप्टेशन विथ रेफरेंस टू ईच स्टेटमेंट दर इज एक्सट्रीम हीट इन डेजर्ट अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस सेंटेंस यू हैव टू राइट अ पैराग्राफ ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन इफ देर इज एक्सट्रीम हीट ऑफ डेजर्ट इन दैट एरिया हाउ शुड बी द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ बॉडी and the life process of plants and animals for example camel rat snake you go to refer that para of desert adaptation and write about plants also like cactus how they survive in this region grassland and lush green grassland grasslands are lush green why these grasslands due to the water availability these grasslands remain green during the rainy season generally these grasses hold their root inside the soil and uh, after the rainfall with the help of sunlight and water this grass growth is nice and that total uh, land is look like a grassland lush green a mountain region also in uh, after rainfall season you may saw that are green zone like lawn third is insects are found in a large number sometimes insects are in a large number so they have two pairs of wings which help them to fly and this adaptation is there they stay near water bodies some are in desert also so they can reproduce in large number due to all such adaptation insects are found in a large number we hide some animals we means not we we hide which animals are hiding about them you have to give information for some animals are hide to save their life from predators so to survive in the atmosphere in surrounding some animals are hiding we have long ears some animals have long ears generally herbivores and uh, this long ears help them to save from predators if they going to attack carnivorous animals this predator are coming near to you because of this long ear they get hint and they can run with their strong legs away so you write this all in a point wise maximum 2 3 point you will make for all a b c d e question and the last question is answer the following this also you write in a nice way in a briefly in your own way also i try to explain questions to you how to write answers instead of giving ready made answers there's no use you also use your own brain question number 5 answer the following why is camel called the ship of desert ship of desert camels are generally used to transport system in a desert area that's why they are called as a ship of the desert transport purpose for heavy load in a desert area it's very difficult to walk but because of the long leg of uh, an ability of camel for adjusting in that surrounding they easily use to go from one place to another you more deeply read about the desert area animal there you get more points about camel and that point also you add here and write down why camel is called the sheep of desert how can plants like cactus and acacia live in desert with care of water you go for the 
para of lesson adaptation in desert area animals plants side what is the interrelationship between adaptations of organisms and their surroundings right interrelationship more maximum three points how are or organisms classified use the hierarchy para how they are classified write down hierarchy definition and write down one example of mango and human there for as a example by showing the groups in last video we saw that para so complete today dear all student this all the question answers with your own way some i gave answer some i explain utilize properly your time when i'm i will send this video i also send a class work some answers wrote question number 1 3 remaining you write in your own way i explain already again repeat repeatedly you listen video and try to write in your own way be safe with your family members next video we'll start with our new lesson lesson number 2 till that time complete your notebook in a nice excellent handwriting way be safe take care bye bye